Hey guys, it's me again, horse lover. Uh, the way I say er, like the last letter from horse lover, is probably iconic because I don't know. I just pronounce it that way. Um, actually, it seemed like you guys liked the last video where I was just talking about random Taylor Swift stuff. Uh, the link is in the description, by the way. So here's another. This one's more about how my channel started, why I started it, and what inspired me. So um, I actually started watching YouTube Shorts a year ago. I don't know why. I just saw my mom watching YouTube Shorts. And I watched it too. And actually, I was just allowed 5 minutes and then 10 minutes. And then, yeah, I don't really have a limit anymore. Uh, but don't tell my parents. Um, no, and when I watched these videos, they were so cool. So first, the YouTube short feed that I had was pretty normal, like random stuff but then it got more olivia rodrigo because maybe you know i'm a huge fan of taylor swift now but i loved olivia once so i watched olivia rodrigo shorts and i decided to upload my first video um it was actually this oh my god look at that face video um it was just the idea i had and i was just joking around with my dad and i don't know i thought other people could like this idea too um so i uploaded it it got pretty much views for first video and a lot of likes too and when i saw how easy it was i uploaded a few next videos they were actually black screen with um text um so they didn't get a lot of views but it was enough for me back then and then I was um, in summer, we went somewhere, my parents and I, and when we came back, I had a lot of beautiful videos. For example, this August Slipped Away video that is on my channel. Um, yeah, and when I uploaded this and I saw that it's really beautiful mixed with the right music, um, <clears throat> I started editing more about Taylor Swift. Actually, I wasn't olivia fan back then so yeah and i didn't edit with real pictures from google because i wasn't sure about copyright so i just i don't know um mixed up stuff in uh, uh wait a second all right pix art sorry i'm not good at remembering names uh so i mixed stuff up there and it turned out pretty cool, but the problem is when you have a um, um, college like this, um, you have to size the video. So my videos <laughs> weren't really that good, but I mean, it was a start. And yeah, and I just started editing somehow. And now I'm at this. I mean, now I have like almost 100 subscribers and i'm talking right now about that and some people are going to listen to it it's amazing um i think that i would probably have lost my courage to really upload stuff um because people around me except my parents of course were pretty mean and they were really making fun of me and bullying me for that um actually my friend subscribed to me because, I mean, at the start, when I wrote them, I have a channel, of course, they subscribe just to be good friends. But, you know what I was really mean? As soon as I had a new subscriber, one of my friends unsubscribed. And they thought I wouldn't see it, but I did. Um, yeah, but then I met a few nice other YouTubers here. And, um, yeah, I don't know, we just got friends and they were supporting they were supporting me no matter how much subscriber I had back then. And now my channel is growing. Thank you so much to everyone. Um, to my music like journey, I can say that first of all, the first music I ever really liked was Adele, probably. Um, 
my mom really likes Adele because yeah she just likes her voice and I can understand it but I'm not really a big fan of Adele but I mean she's really talented so we were listening to Adele in a car when we were traveling and singing along to the songs and I remember it was pretty much fun then um, in school we had like something where people played their favorite music and someone played Monster by Imagine Dragons and if you know me I mean I'm a Taylor Swift fan so it seems like I like really deep lyrics and Monster was just a song for me that I loved um, then in my next school someone played faded on a piano and it sounded beautiful so i played it too so i went to my music teacher and i was like can we play faded and um yeah we played it so i listened to faded but yeah i don't really know um it was cool but not that cool and i heard a few alan walker songs like sing me to sleep or alone with Ava Max. That's still one of my favorites. And um, yeah, then I switched to Olivia Rodrigo in 2021. We moved to a new city. And um, my mom always picked me up with a car from school and brought me there with the car. And in a car, I started listening to radio. I never listened to radio before because I thought it was like something boring. But, um, yeah, seems like it isn't. And then with, tr with my dad, we went back a few times to the old city. And, um, yeah, then they played driver's license. And, f I mean, first of all, I made fun of Olivia's voice because, was, because you know, it was somehow high-pitched. But I started liking it. And then I googled it and listened to it on YouTube non-stop. But I have to say, after I heard of the skin drama with driver's license, I listen to driver's license and skin all the time. I love both. And yeah, then I listened to Sour. Um, I was really obsessed with Olivia's music for like more of a year, more than a year. I think a year and a half, maybe. I don't know right now and then I switched to Taylor and yeah now I'm still a Taylor Swift fan um if you see me uploading Harry Styles videos it's not because I love his music I mean as it was it's pretty good but I'm not really a fan of him or One Direction but I think he's a funny person and he seems really nice so I do it yeah that's all I can tell right now um if I can think of another stuff to do, uh, I will probably upload a new video for you guys. And I would say uh, see you next time or hear you next time. I don't know. Bye.